Is internet marketing worth it? So many people believe that growing your business online is very difficult to do. Why? Because online is saturated. Everybody is online now and you know the competition is hefty. How do you stand out? How do you stand out from the crowd? And how do you get your business, your opportunity, your product out there so that people and consumers that are looking for your opportunity or looking to join your company, whether you're in network marketing or general entrepreneur, to raise their hands and say, hey, they're interested and get those sales and get those signups. So in this video, I'm gonna be covering three things that you should be implementing in your internet marketing. But here's the key, like Gary V said, you're supposed to market in your time, right? Market in your time period. And the thing is that internet is not going anywhere, right? It's here to stay and there's no if, ands, or buts about it. And so the question shouldn't really be, is internet marketing worth it? The question you should be asking is what uh, types of internet marketing should you be using, right? Because there's a whole bunch of different types of internet marketing out there. It's very easy to get bogged down, very easy to get information overload. Where do you start? What do you do, right? Well, in this video, I'm going to be going over three high components of internet marketing that you should be incorporating into your business to help you get the best results and to help you grow your business online and to stand out from the competition. The first skill or component of internet marketing that you really want to master is SEO or search engine optimization. Now, you've probably heard this term before. If you haven't, just to give you a brief definition of it, search engine optimization is basically what allows you to be found on the internet. So what's the point of having like a company, a product, a service, a website, uh, um, whatever, and people aren't finding it, right? You could spend hours making something, creating something, and those hours go to waste because nobody can find that stuff. Well, knowing search engine optimization allows you to be able to be found by Google when people are searching for uh, something that's related to your company or to your product. So if you know how to master search engine optimization, then you'll know how to be able to put your your product or your business in front of the people that are actually looking for it, your target audience. And most importantly, you'll be able to rank those things on Google and YouTube, which is the you know best, highest search engines out there right now on the market. And if you're able to do that, then you automatically position yourself for success and set yourself apart from competition. You're gonna be those people that people are going to find through the search engine optimizations. And there's a couple of ways to go about that. Um, and how to use keyword ranking and doing research to help you best position yourself for success when people are looking for exactly what you're trying to offer. So the second thing component of internet marketing that you should be implementing if you're not already is blogging. Now blogging does get a little bit of like a regular, you know, rap. Like people don't think blogging is really that big of a deal. Well, blogging can actually be a huge difference in your business if you incorporate blogging the right way. There's two things that online that you actually own and that's your online email list and your blog, right? And your blog could be the central hub for you to uh, drive traffic to, to get people to know who you are and to actually um, build those relationships with those people through your blog. Now, the important thing about a blog is that it helps you set yourself up as an authority figure. And if you set yourself up as an authority figure in your particular niche or in your particular area, then people are just going to be, are gonna be more inclined to come to, to you and do business with you if you have a blog. So knowing how to blog is also a very huge advantage in internet marketing. And if you're not doing that yet, it's something that I would highly consider doing. Third and final uh, tip or um, component of internet marketing that if you're not implementing into your uh, business plan that is video marketing. Video marketing back in the day was an option. It was like, you know, if you wanted to do it, cool. If you didn't want to do it, no problem. But today, it's more of a must. If you're not doing video marketing, you're missing out on a huge chunk of potential customers and clients because video marketing is a great way to brand yourself. Not only brand yourself, but it's also a great way to get people to know, like, and trust you, which are the three factors that you got to have if people are going to do business from you and buy from you ultimately, right? So video marketing is key. Now, a lot of people get the shivers thinking about video. They're not comfortable with that, which is perfectly fine. There are other ways and means to apply video marketing into your business to help you still get the benefits of video marketing and still be able to, you know, deal with the comfortability of being on camera until, you know, you, you're, you're able to do that. Video marketing is huge component 
If you're not doing that yet, highly recommend to do it. So is internet marketing worth it? Yes, 100%, it's definitely worth it. But it becomes even more worth it when you know exactly what you should be doing and the, and the components that you can be using in your business to help you get the best results and stick, um, stick out from the competition. And those three things is search engine optimization, blogging, and video marketing. Now, if you have any questions about these three topics or you just wanna learn more about how you can incorporate these topics into your business, check out the links that I'll have down below in the description because I'm gonna be providing free training for both social uh, search engine optimization, blogging, and video marketing. So any of those three topics interest you and you are thinking about trying to incorporate that into your business because those are the three key components um, uh, that you should be implementing for internet marketing to help you grow your business online. Check out those links um, down below in the description. And also check out the blog, my blog down below in the description as well because that's where I have all my tips and tricks for growing your business online, whether you're a network marketing, an entrepreneur, a brick and mortar business, direct sales, it doesn't matter. It's all universal principles. So check that out down below in the description as well. And don't forget to also like and comment this video. If you found value from this video, leave a comment down below and check out my uh, fan page as well where I have plenty more business tips to help you be a boss entrepreneur and help you grow your business online. So with that being said, I'm Gabe E and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.